Welcome everybody. Welcome to my snow plowing and repo slash towing business. I'm so excited to do some snow removal on a legit cool Midwest map. So let's zoom out here. We're on the Midwest horizon map. A lot of farm ground, a lot of farms and a lot of like little, I think there's a few little small towns right now. It's like mixing between rain and sleet here. Let me turn that down for you. That's kind of, uh, it's kind of loud. There we go. Oh, that didn't really, there we go. So it's snowing it's actually like turning to rain kind of weird but anyway snow is on the ground and yeah it's like turning to sleet so we need to get out there we need to start spreading some salt and plowing but welcome guys i want to start so this is an extension this is another business i'm starting keeping the uh excavating company going but we just moved to a different town i saw that this town really had snow good no good remo snow removal there are a lot of complaints from people and i had a few customers actually that i did some excavating work for say like hey like you seem like you have the resources to do this and i was like yeah i always want to do snow removal and so right now here is the shop we we bought this land we bought the shop i bought two dot one and then the other one is down there that 10 wheeler six wheeler and then here's the company truck that you guys saw me driving in the excavating uh in our excavating company so that's that and we bought those two dot trucks at a at a like dot auction so we just picked them up perfect time and we just got dumped on so i was just running around plowing a little bit we need to i need to like clear the shop but first i need to clear the streets so there are just so many like country roads, so many back roads. First, I'm gonna try and get to like the main roads and then people are just snowed in. So check this monster out. I got the 10 wheeler salt spreader. We need to fill up with salt, but I, I gotta go to fill up with salt first. We don't have one here. And then I got the, uh, just the V plow here. So it'll shoot buff from the side. Then we have the side plow. I'm hoping one pass is gonna be able to, uh, to clear the road two is fine because like i guess we have to turn around but i'm hoping one pass all right let's drop her down there's gonna be cars there's gonna be uh all that stuff but guys please smash the like button if you want to see more episodes like this honestly i'm just gonna keep recording them even if you guys don't like them because i have a lot of fun doing it it's it's pretty fun it, it's it's like really fun if you guys haven't done snow removal removal before okay what are we stuck on all right there we go we're moving i don't think the side plows like uh like any divots in the road I'm, I'm just kind of figuring that out all right there we go we are on our way oh my goodness this is so sick this is so cool if we could just follow the road oh okay there's really no first person view sorry about that guys i kind of wanted one. Oh my we're going right down the highway oh my goodness i'll try and link these up i believe i actually don't know if they're public or private i need to find that out first and then i'll link it up check this out guys all right we're just gonna go straight here push this pile oh my goodness guys we are gonna clear the road so fast just check that out check out what we just did that is insane we need to get these cases cleared out but what our job is is we are we are not like i know it says dot on there it's just because i just bought it from an auction but we are a private company in an extension off i i'm using the funds from our excavating company that we made and then we i like i bought the obviously the land and all the trucks and then obviously once we get these roads cleared i'm gonna be there's a lot of probably cars we got to start towing out and it looks like oops it looks like tonight this is gonna turn this rain it's actually kind of warm out right now this rain is gonna turn there we go perfect all right i'm good this rain is going to turn into uh, into ice, so we need to take care of that as well. Let me put my cruise control on so we don't get going too fast and then damage one of the plows or something crazy like that. There we go. Oh, I wish I had first person. It's, this is what first person is. It, it doesn't really work, but we are just knocking out these roads. It's pretty crazy. Oh my goodness, but we are on mid Midwest Horizon. It's based off Ohio Super flat perfect for snow removal It looks like it it looks just too clean fs19 snow removal is just insane Look at the pile we are pushing in front of us. I wonder Can I here? I'll move it around Do something like that or I'll just go straight There we go perfect We'll bump up the speed here just a bit. Honestly, it's a little... I mean, I feel like 
what there's four inches on the ground maybe five which is a good amount especially where i live uh you know five wet inches i guess the truck would be able to do it if we we're having good grip but this is a lot of snow we're pushing at one time we have a right wing a left wing and then a v plow in the front which is just dis distributing to the left and the right this is pretty cool though all right we're coming up on a farm i'm gonna pull in this is a uh, i know this is an older gentleman that it so we're gonna try and at least get some of his land here cleared some of his farm all right there's the mailbox all right let's uh let's back it up here so what the plan is we want to okay where so there's his barn where's his okay there's his garage we always want to keep in mind where everything's at all right we found the road i gotta be careful i don't want to accidentally damage something but it's tough it's tough i'm not used to uh not used to plow in these places so i need to fold the wings up and we're just going to use the front plow right now because it's just too dangerous i might damage something might damage uh his farm so let's just i'm not going to get this place perfect that's kind of his job but i know he was an older gentleman and i want to make sure that they can get out in case they need like medical supplies and stuff like that so it's kind of our job too to take care of the older people there we go. Oh, he's got a really nice driveway. Let's be careful here. Probably one more on the left side here, and then we'll get back on the road. Um. Yeah, and the and the side plows do not work good for any uneven ground. Even though you can't even really tell this is uneven, it still really, really, really struggles. It's kind of interesting. All right, hopefully he can i can't do too much with the plow because of uh obviously it's a plow it's not like a snow thrower all right fold them down there we go we'll, we'll widen it just a bit there for him there we are all right what i'm gonna do now run a pretty cool time lapse and we're gonna try and clear a lot of road here guys enjoy guys so we are i took this really long like six mile run here spanning out and in and i just didn't want to get too far right now so i don't really have any employees i don't really have any help and i'm like literally gonna go out and hire people tonight i already have four interviews that are going on so hopefully i can get people hired here like to work like tonight uh so they're just gonna show up at the shop if i like no they're gonna be bad i probably won't have them or i'll just hire them for the night or we'll kind of see how that goes so that is why i didn't go too far i just went a uh a span around here i'll show you real quick i just went around this block not too bad but uh i just want to make sure everything's good on the truck again i haven't really ran it this hard it is a uh used dot truck with not too many miles for the year but I guess wherever it was they didn't get a lot of snow so that was that was good and it only had i think they i don't even think they used a dump truck too so that was really good to see and it was pretty good buy so all right we're heading up here now 
I'm trying to keep the mile per hour down, especially on the like curvy roads. We don't know everything, and I'm not totally used to these roads. So there we go. But this plow is working so good, guys. Again, if you are enjoying today's episode, please hit the like button. We're gonna be at the shop here in a minute, and then we're gonna start plowing that, picking some things, um, picking some things up, and clearing some more snow. So I'll see you guys when we get there in a second. All right, so we're pulling in. It's getting heavy around here. And then on this dip, we do struggle with the uh, with the wings. They don't. They almost bottom out. If that kind of makes sense. Oh, there we go. All right, we need to put it back down. There we are. And it's yeah, it's kind of tough, honestly, plowing with the wings in some in like tight situations so i almost want to get uh like our smaller like our six wheeler in here like this is great for just running up and down like we cleared so much look at the roads they look like they they're like picture perfect oh yeah i forgot we can't we can't go through here all right so i'm cleaning up this outside here oh my god it just works so good it's so nice to see the snow just get out of the way all right, we'll come around this side. But this is our, our shop. This is the shop we're going to be running pretty much everything out of, unless we expand bigger down the road, which I can see that happen happening. Uh, we're going to be doing towing. We'll be doing repoing. We'll just everything in terms of big vehicle equipment. We'll be doing snow removal, maybe some tree services down the road. Not too sure on that. All right, what are we stuck on? That's like the only problem is sometimes these side plows like get in the way, but they do such a good job. I can't, I can't get mad at them. I just can't get mad at them. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to, uh, so the really hard thing. Okay. Come on. 10 wheeler. Yeah. See, it's a little, look at that. So you see the slope that throws the side plows off. So what I'm thinking about doing is almost acting like we're going to be mowing. If that makes sense. And Oh, wait, can I turn around? Yeah, we should be able to turn around. So I'm going to do the outside first. Or wait, will that even work? Should work. So I'm going to try and clear this lot out. And even on the insides of the shop. So a little unrealistic, but the insides of the shop are uh, are snowed in as well. So that's, that's kind of like, it's really unrealistic, but it's kind of funny too. So we're going to have to clear those out. That's not going to be perfect because like it's, it's gonna be really hard to, to like plow that out of the way so there we go can we come on so what my plan is if this works which i'm hoping it will seems like is the ground really that even and i can't raise these guys up either they're down or they're up which is kind of weird okay let's try this struggling a little bit with this but we should be able to get it to work i'm just gonna run a u yeah will that work yeah i'm just gonna try and go in a u pattern and then there we go plow around these guys perfect just like that so we're just gonna run that and then what i'm gonna do, i actually think this might be a good idea so then i will here, I'll fold that guy up and then fold that one down. We'll switch the V to go to the right and then we'll run another course and clear this out. That is that is actually works pretty good. So I don't have any of my trucks or my towing trucks down here. I have to clear this place out before I get them down, obviously. So that is our first priority. Holy cow, that's a lot of snow. That's a lot of snow. Do you have any Christmas? That's a lot of snow. Holy cow. All right, are we stuck? Let me take another push on it. Let me take another crack at it. But yeah, we gotta we gotta wait a little bit for the tow trucks, and then we're gonna try and run this as a super realistic series. Get some employees down here, some new uh, some new faces. So let me know if you guys find that interesting as well. We're just gonna and then correct me on anything I don't do realistic because. There are things that I don't know. Like, I just, I have no idea what is realistic 
in that certain situation which hopefully that makes sense to you guys too but i think right now honestly we're just pushing everything to the right with the side plow and it's just gonna get really 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 heavy here soon which i don't know is if that's a good thing but we'll see we'll see how it works all right we'll drop the other one lift the other one the corners are kind of tough There we go. All right, that's not too bad. It's actually, I'm, I'm just trying to think of the most efficient way because this moves so much snow. Obviously, the only problem is uh, it's not like a huge wheel loader where we're actually picking the snow up. We're just moving it to a less obvious spot, less inconvenient spot. All right corners are always tough i always miss some look at how much snow this is oh we're buckling we're buckling down go baby go come on come on there we go push 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 maybe just go straight there we go we just need to get some of that snow out of here and then take a crack at it here i just ate these these trucks back up really really slow they're great for going straight they're just really slow backing up that's that's the main problem and then my plan is to kind of clean up the rest with the you know like the six wheeler or something smaller i guess maybe i'll just back up it seems like it's almost a bit easier but we'll kind of see so yeah welcome to the shop guys i'll be cleaning out uh i'll be cleaning out with one of our workers tonight let me know what you guys want to see we're gonna to have to clear off all the highways we'll have a lot more episodes come in new vehicles new everything we have we have a lot coming so repoing is back as well and then this is season so the snow is going to go away we'll run seasons like we'll run the through the seasons fairly quickly in terms of episodes so let me know what you guys think of that too is any feedback on those so thanks guys for watching peace out i know today's episode was a bit shorter but we just got to keep removing so Again, guys, appreciate it for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the like button. And let me know if you guys enjoyed. Thanks.